Okay, he's online. Okay, so let's do it. D4. All right, so let's uh, let's let's try to do let's try to do e5. Uh, yeah, let's do e5. Something different. Those of you who play, ah, look at that. Okay, guys, those of you who are asking for sharp candidate, uh, I mean openings. Let's talk about this. Uh, one line that I like is queen h4. So if you ever play against the king's gambit, consider this, okay? Now, what's the idea behind this simple variation? Well, I put my queen back. I know wasted time, but now I'm putting, I'm x raying the pawn on e4. So I take, and I'm now gonna take on e4, unless they protect it, of course. Well, I'm gonna get greedy. If I die, I'm already, already at least, I got a few pawns. I got a few pawns there. All right, so knight f6. And let's see. Okay, you know what? I know that you're... Let me see, do I have you? Because for some reason I don't have you. Well, I don't think I have your, your username. Let me have your... Let me put you up here. And let me have your, your username, okay? Okay. Now, bishop g5. I know that that's in the air. I know that's in the air. Mm. Uh, should we care? Well, let's go here. Let's see. <laughs> All right. Nice to see you here. Glad to see that you guys are here helping, uh, supporting the channel. Um, now, queen d6, queen c5, or queen b4. Let me start with queen d6. Mm, yeah, why not? Queen d6. Getting away from that pin, also oh, uh, leaving some room here for, for my bishop. Um, let's see. <laughs> so maybe <laughs> maybe I was just putting it all wrong. I don't know. Uh, King's Gambit. Yep. Uh, George, but your your account said unless I put the the wrong username, it says that you were um, you were your account was closed. Um, guys, this could be trouble. But this is a free pawn. I'm sorry. If we lose this, if we lose this, what can we what can we say? What can we do? Okay. Um. Hmm. Alright, let me try this. Now, guys, let me know what you think of that move. Maybe you considered it already. Uh, but I think that makes sense. No? Okay, I think I put it without the underscore. And it took me to, to what we got. But I tried again. No worries. Um, mm, mm, Alright, you got it. You got it. So, that, I, put it, I put it without the underscore. And the only thing that showed up on chess.com was, was that account. Because typically it shows you... Other accounts are similar, they have similar spelling, but that's what came out. It's not that I didn't put the underscore, I put it as you, as you said it. But anyways, I will do it, I will do it again, okay? 95 was better. Uh, was it forcing though? I don't, I don't know if it, if it was forcing. Okay, now this was a mistake. Um, guys, 95, what I liked about 94 is that I'm hitting the queen too. 95, maybe they could have done, oh no, they couldn't. So yeah, I think you're right. It was probably better. Uh, wait, that was already played. Okay, so now this is just a free piece. So guys, this is what happens. If you play the King's Gambit, you gotta make sure that your tactics are, that you're training your tactics. This becomes really tactical. Look at this, this is not your typical middle game possession. And if you don't know what you're doing, you're gonna, you're gonna be all played. All right, uh, good game. Just make sure you review that line with Queen H4. And those of you guys who play E5, also, why not take a look at that queen h4? And maybe it's just simple enough for you to have it in your repertoire. If someone plays king's gambit, you don't have to go into anything complicated.